Alrighty, this is Classic Cars Palm Beach. Gonna be doing a walk around video on this uh, Magnum RT Hemi 2007. Uh, point of this video for anybody looking at it is for me to point out all the flaws on the car, any any uh, nicks, dents, curb rash on the wheel, bug marks on the front, uh, you know, tire condition, all that stuff. Excess wear and tear on the interior. I just want you all to know exactly what this car is going to be like when you receive it, if you buy it. So, uh, here we go. I'm going to get on the front. I'm going to get kind of detailed here. It's stuff you might not even be able to pick up on the camera. But there's a couple little teeny nicks on the front. I mean, so nips, nips, nips minor. They're like uh, the, the, the point of the pin. Not even, a, not even as big as a pin head. But if you can see right here, there's a couple of little bug marks right here on the plastic. Okay. A couple of them. That'd be a very simple fix to have this painted and make it perfect, but I still want to show those to people. But you can't even see them if you're standing back away from the car. Like if I'm standing back here, I can't even tell. It's got bug marks on it, but it's got a few on there. And there's a couple little pinhead sized nicks in the car. I can't even see where my finger is on the camera there. There's one right there, and there's one right up on top here. All right, besides that, that's going to be pretty much the only thing you're going to see with this thing that's not perfect because. This is the nicest Magnum I've seen in years and years and years. I'm going to go all the way down the side here. First of all, we're going to hit this wheel. Let you see that there's, uh, I don't see any curb rash on this front passenger side wheel. You've got good deep tread on that tire, man. A lot of tread left on the tire. Uh, probably 75, 80%. Okay, we're going to go down the side here, the passenger side. Everything is perfect. I don't see any dents, dings, scratches, nothing, man. And this is beautiful paint on this car. This paint is just beautiful with that little metallic in that black paint. That thing is gorgeous. Uh, it's kind of a paint made for this car, kind of. This wheel doesn't have any curb rash on it. Once again, you're going to have, you got real good tread on that tire. Okay, coming around the back of the car. All right. There's the back of the vehicle. I don't see any dents or damage on here. A couple little maybe hair scratches. No, I can't even tell if that, no. That's gonna come out with my finger. Might be a couple teeny hair scratches. You can't even really. That might just. That's a reflection, actually. I think that's a reflection. Is what that is. Yeah, I'm gonna lift up the back here. This will tell you what kind of guy this guy was who had this car before. He's got all this stuff in here. First of all, he's got original maps still in the bag with the car. Then he's got the whole manual, the whole repair manual on the vehicle. And then he's got some other stuff back. Oh, he's got, I guess I heard there was brakes. All brand new brakes and rotors and everything have never been used. Brand new. They don't need to be put on now. The rotors or brakes are fine. This is just extra stuff this guy had for this car. Okay. You can see the interior here, just, just spotless. No, no, you know, scratches or anything in the plastic where there usually is in the back of these things. Um, what the heck is this he's got here? Got something else here evolution ceramic brake and this is the brake pads that go with those calipers and, uh, and those rotors I mean so good stuff here good stuff shows you what kind of guy this guy was shocks in this hood this uh, trunk litter really tight a lot of resistance so we're coming around the driver's side now okay look at this wheel here this guy is the type of guy he ain't gonna have any curb rash on this wheel Bunch of tread left on his tires too. Okay, we're gonna look up top here. I don't see any any dings or imperfections up in the roof area. None at all. Coming down this side here. Okay, there's a little mark right here. I don't know if you let me see where my finger is. A little mark right here, but that feels like it will buff out. That's not in the paint. It looks like just some kind of a smudge. Okay, we're coming all the way down the front here. Nothing on these sides, man. This car is just immaculate. Now I'm sounding like I'm selling it. I'm not supposed to be. I'm supposed to be pointing out flaws. We need a whole lot to pour down on this car. Okay, coming around the wheels, perfect. Tire's good again, man. Wait, now you're gonna see the best part. This interior is unbelievable. I don't know how the guy could keep this color interior this clean. No wear and tear on the armrest. Nothing at all. Steering wheel, no wear and tear. You know, from hand marks. Look at this seat. Where you get in and out of the seat, how that bolster is usually tore up. Nothing. What a nice color. Not too white, like white interior. It's kind of like a cream. 
but it's nice and cool to get into and sit on in the state of Florida but uh, it's still got a little color to it so it don't show so much dirt dash everything is perfect on this car man don't see any any wear and tear even on the shifting handle okay a little dirty on the floor mat it's got sand in it when I got in it but carpets are real nice floor mats are nice that all be cleaned up all right we'll go to the back seats and that'll be it once again just like you'd expect no wear and tear getting into these things none whatsoever carpets floor mats perfect vents air vents everything right back seat map pockets not all pulled out and stretched out all right well there you go man did my best show you exactly what this thing's like so uh this classic cars of palm beach if i didn't answer a question that you have about it just give us a call thanks